Hey guys. Oops. Last night we had, or uh, well this morning we had a low of 1.3 Celsius here in uh, this neck of the woods in Melbourne. The greenhouse right now is at uh, close to 19 Celsius, which is pretty awesome at uh, 11 a.m. And uh, look at this. New growth on the on the uh, on the mango, the seedling. Look at that. Pretty good. So pretty excited about the turn of uh, weather here. We're off to the beach, believe it or not. As soon as we um, have our breakfast or brunch as it's gonna be four days of incredible weather coming up the best weather that we've had this month the month of May and uh, forecast is only uh, 15 to 19 Celsius which is around uh, 60 to 66 and that's enough for us to go to the beach as long as it's full sun not a problem not a problem guys and there's gonna be hundreds of people there walking because of the um, the lockdown all right people not working so what they're doing is they're walking instead of working so we'll see you from the beach catch us on our real life adventures um, on my other channel and you'll see how beautiful the beach is in late autumn here in Melbourne Check it out. Check it out. Marvelous blue skies all around. So exciting to get some good weather during the cold, colder seasons. Love it. It's only uh, 8.5, 9 degrees out here in the garden compared to the greenhouse that was 19. So it's 10 degrees Celsius colder out here in the, in the open under the ice cream bean in the shade. Huge difference, guys, with the greenhouse. Yeah, it's full sun. But it's still 9 Celsius in the shade. Whew, it's freezing under here. But still beautiful. Yep, we're off to the beach. Have to enjoy this wonderful sunshine. Here in the, uh, the temperate climate. So... While it might not be the true tropics, where it's usually between 20 and 30 all uh, winter, even here in the much cooler temperate climate in uh, Melbourne, where it's only uh, 10 to 16 Celsius in winter, we still have um, beautiful days like this. Awesome days like this usually around two days a week all winter like this so this is pretty much our abode here all year even in uh, the cooler uh, months it's still very good guys it's still very good just giving you a a view all around how it how it is even in um, wintry weather when it's sunny yep you wouldn't know that it's uh, 9 Celsius or um, 50 
what is it 56 57 fahrenheit you wouldn't know right looks like summer doesn't it exactly so that's why i'm encouraging you all to go tropo with me go tropical and uh you can feel the tropics even on the coldest wintry days That's why I'm encouraging you guys. Grandpa and Grandma, here in our temperate climate, are indoors, putting our firewood in the stove and in the kunara or um, fireplace because they're fruit trees are done see you later see you again in spring right what's that that's uh, May June July August so for four months they're gonna be in the house filling up the fireplace with wood <clears throat> because their um, stone fruit the deciduous trees are sleeping there's nothing going on so why not have the, the best of both worlds instead of just one one side of it right this cold alpine weather uh, look for uh, four months have both look the best of both worlds right this is the tropical white sapote tropical mulberry another tropical white sapote and tropical guava right tropical white sapote again another tropical white sapote over there Cussed apple here, another tropical white sapote there, and on and on, guys, and on and on. So, we're off to the beach now. Catch us, as I said, from our other channel and see what we do, not only in summer but also in winter. All year, guys, we're getting our vitamin D, sea minerals, and uh, getting earthed with uh, sand so thanks for watching this video hope you liked it put a like and uh, subscribe if you haven't and we'll see you from the next video guys